This segment of Coast Life is sponsored by Shell's Early Learning Center. Paige, uh, a couple weeks ago, yeah. or maybe it was even just last week, okay. we celebrated time. Uh, we celebrated Teacher Appreciation Week. Yes, we did. And I know a lot of teachers felt a lot of love mm -hmm. and a lot of appreciation over the past couple weeks, but nobody appreciates their staff better than Shell's Early Learning Aww. Center. Lachelle and Angela do a wonderful job making mm -hmm. sure that it's not just the kids that are having fun at Shell's yeah. Early Learning, it's their staff too. That's important. They also know that it's important that they are highly trained and qualified yes. for everything that they do to make sure they are setting up your kids for success. So we are gonna take a look at how Lachelle and Angela and Shell's Early Learning Center not only appreciates their teachers, but has them trained and qualified as well. So let's take a look. Parents know looking for the perfect place to send your child for early childhood education is no easy task. It's hard to tell which daycare centers are qualified and which ones are essentially a babysitting service. At Shell's Early Learning Center, you don't have to worry about the qualifications of the staff because Lachelle and Angela make sure their team is highly trained. We aren't babysitters at all. Actually, we are all certified through the Department of Education. Uh, we go not only go through training hours that we have to have annually, as well as we also provide our teachers with the ability to get certifications um, to go above and beyond and Department of Education standards of early child education teachers. We have teachers that not only have high school diplomas, we have teachers that have their associate's degree, bachelor's degree, and even their master's degrees. So we are always making sure that our teachers are highly qualified. And one of the things that you want to enhance on, Angela, is this year, um, we pretty much started a Shells University, yes. whereas we don't have to have training through Department of Education because, because our veteran teachers have taken every class that they have on their website, and now they can take those classes through us at Shells University. I'm calling it Shells University <laughs> because that's what it is, and not only can they get they, those training hours, they can also get their CDAs. We recently celebrated Teacher Appreciation Week, and no one appreciates their teachers and staff quite like Shells Early Learning Center. So today is a day to celebrate our teachers. It's Teacher Appreciation Day. They need to have their training as well too. We thank our parents for supporting us through this because in previous years they would be so, uh, some people would be upset with us closing, but we had to. We gotta give our teachers that moment to think, to grow, to learn, and to enjoy what they're doing. And that's what our training day is about, especially this year. We're giving back to our teachers in that way. We've gotten them lunch, we gave them breakfast, we're gonna give them snacks. We um, danced. Yes, we did dance. <laughs> we danced. Yes, we danced. <laughs> Maybe rapped a little bit in there. I think we rapped. <laughs> we dropped karaoke. the mic a little bit. A little karaoke going on. But um, just to show our teachers that, you know, we just need to continue having fun. Shell's Early Learning Center is, of course, a space of play and learning for the kids. And when it comes to training their teachers, they implement the same techniques. Um, we like to laugh, we like to have fun, we get up, we move around, we play games. We did heads up, seven up um, earlier. We have the big old Jeopardy game going on that everyone gets a little hostile about. Uh, we got the <laughs> trophies for trophy. it, we have a trophy. So this we year, make we it trophy, fun. Yes. And the point with the games and these experiences is that the teachers are learning. Um, and it's a great way to not only teach our teachers, how to learn when you're also, um, you know, learn and have fun at the same time, but now they can implement that with the students. We can play and have fun and they can also learn at the same time. Having fun and learning at the same time is what Shell's Early Learning Center is all about, and no one knows that better than the staff. One way I have fun is always by keeping a smile on my face, making sure everyone is, everyone in the building is always just laughing, always cracking jokes, playing with the kids. I love the kids, especially my four-year-old kids. They always know how to keep a smile on my face. The appreciation is really big because um, with, as a man teacher, you know, it's hard to find it sometimes. You know, you get judged a lot for being um, in a facility like this because it's so-called a woman-dominant job. But once you get appreciative and people understand how good you are as a teacher or whatever you do in um, a daycare center, it's always appreciated, so I like that. My favorite part is just the open welcome to everything. Like I said, I didn't have that at the other places I was at. I've been doing this since I was um, 19. And this is the first place I ever felt like I was welcomed and appreciated. And it's just very nice to know that I got people here to be able to help me and guide me if I ever stray or um, need the guidance. 
I also love hearing from the staff and hearing them talk about how appreciated they feel, yeah. uh, especially from the men, the male yeah. teachers that they have, because it is kind of a, a women dominated field and they also feel the love and appreciation yes. from Shell's Early Learning and Center. And the kids do too. Oh my gosh. They are yes, so they loved. Do. You can tell they have so much fun. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> it's the best. But we also have a lot of creative artists that are the best mm -hmm. and uh, people that are just really, really gifted and talented. And there is a artisan craft fair coming up Ooh. that we've got more details on when we get back.